And this video is to show you how to play arpeggios of G major and A minor one octave in the right hand and the left hand for grade one piano. So for G major arpeggio, I'm going to start with my thumb on G. I'm going to just reach my second finger up to B and my third finger up to D and then find G at the top with my fifth finger. I then turn straight round again and play D with my third finger again, B with my second finger, and G with my thumb. So here's that a little bit faster. G with thumb, B with second finger, D with third finger, G with fifth finger, back to D with third finger, B with second finger, and G with thumb. And here's that without me saying anything. Now you'd be pleased to know that A minor has exactly the same shape, but just starts one note higher. So I'm now going to start with my thumb on A. And because it's the same shape, I'm going to reach my second finger to C, and my third finger to E, and my fifth finger up to A. Follow it backwards again. Third finger goes on E, second finger goes on C, thumb on A. So here's that without me saying anything. And now here's the same things in the left hand. So I'm going to start with my fifth finger on G. I'm going to reach my fourth finger to B, second finger to D, and thumb on G at the top. I turn around again and do second finger on D, fourth finger on B, trust me it works better than third, and five on G at the bottom. So here's that a little bit quicker, 5 on G, 4 on B, 2 on D, thumb on G, come back to 2 on D, 4 on B, and 5 on G. And here's that without me saying anything. And again, just like for the right hand, when we do A minor, it's going to be exactly the same shape. Just starting one note higher, so now I get my fifth finger on A, fourth finger on C, second finger on E, thumb on A at the top. I turn back round again and get second finger on E, fourth finger on C, fifth finger on A, and here's that without me saying anything. And that's all the arpeggios that you'll need to know for grade one. So I hope that helps and happy practicing.